Step one, wake up early, gon' rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, think real hard about what you wanna be. Step four, fuck everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. 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 Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So today we're going to make this very cute gecko or lizard applica. So get your materials ready and let's get started. Okay, so we are going to start by making a chain 19. I already did that. Okay, and now starting in the second chain from the hook. So we'll count one and here we are going to do a single crochet. And then we'll do half double crochet in the next chain. And then we'll do double crochet in the next two chains. So double crochet. And double crochet in the next chain. And then from here, we are going to make the first leg. And for the leg, we are going to do a chain six. So we'll do chain one, two, three, four, five, and six. And then we'll slip stitch in the fourth chain from the hook. So we'll count one, two, three, four. And here in the fourth chain, we'll slip stitch. Okay, so that makes our first toe and then we'll do a chain three. So one, two, three, and then we'll slip stitch in the same stitch we slip stitched before. So slip stitch, that's the second toe. And then again, we'll do a chain three. So one, two, three, and then we'll slip stitch here again, but we'll make sure to go uh, before here in the previous stitch so that we close the gap. So slip stitch. And then in the remaining two stitches here in the chain, uh, in the chain six uh, stitch that we made, we are going to do single crochet here in the next chain. And single crochet here also in the last chain. Okay, so after we're done with that, in the next stitch here in our body, we are going to do an improvised double crochet. So we're just going to put our hook through the chain that was after uh, the double crochet that we made over here before we started our leg. Uh, so we're going to do here in the body and uh, put our crochet hook through and then pull through like that and then we're going to do a normal double crochet in the same stitch and then we'll pull through two strands of yarn and then we'll have one two three and we'll pull through all the three strands of yarn like that okay and then after that now we are going to do two double crochet in the next stitch in the next chain sorry so we'll do double crochet and another double crochet in the same chain and then we'll do double crochet in the next stitch And then in the next one again, we'll do two double crochet in the same chain.
and then double crochet in the next chain and then again we'll do two double crochet in the next chain and double crochet in the next chain And then we'll make the second leg so we'll do a chain six so one two three four five six so we're making it the same way we did the first leg and then in the fourth chain from the hook one two three four we're going to slip stitch and then we'll do a chain three one two three so slip stitch while we slip stitched in the for the first toe. Then again we'll do a chain three. One, two, three. And then we'll slip stitch over here. Just to make sure we close the gap like that. And then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitch uh two chains for the leg so we'll do single crochet and single crochet in the remaining one chain for the leg Okay, like that and then again we'll do our improvised double crochet so we'll put our hook through the next chain of the body and pull through and then we'll do a normal double crochet so make sure you don't pull through we'll have two hooks two uh, loops on our hook so one two so we'll then double crochet in the same stitch and then pull through two loops so we have one two three three loops remaining and then pull through all the remaining three loops like that okay so now we do half double crochet in the next stitch And then single crochet in the next two stitches so we'll do single crochet in the next chain and single crochet also in the next chain and then in the next chain we'll do two double crochet so we'll do two double crochet in the same chain Okay, and then half double crochet in the next chain okay and then in the last chain of the first half of the lizard we are going to do four single crochets in the same chain so we'll do single crochet one then again in the same chain single crochet two then single crochet three and single crochet four all in the same chain okay so now we are going to crochet on the other half of the other side of our lizard okay and we're going to start by doing half double crochet so we're going to do half double crochet in the next chain of the other side 
and then we'll do two double crochet in the next chain so double crochet one and then another double crochet in the same chain and then we'll do single crochet in the next two chains so we'll do single crochet and single crochet in the next chain also And then we'll do half double crochet in the next chain okay and then we'll make the third leg just that like the way we did the others so chain six one two three four five six then in the fourth chain from the hook one two three four we slip stitch and then chain three one two three slip stitch while we slip stitch in the for the first toe again and then chain three one two three and then slip stitch again over here but slightly at the back just to close the gap and then we'll do single crochet in the remaining two stitches of the leg Two chains sorry so we'll do single crochet and single crochet here then when we go come back again to the body here we'll do our improvised double crochet so we'll just put our hook through and pull through a loop then do the normal double crochet pull through two loops then you have three loops remaining and pull through all the three loops okay so now in the next chain we'll do double crochet two together so yarn over go into the next chain pull through and then go into the next chain and pull through so we'll have one two three four four loops on your hook so you pull through two loops and then you pull through the other three loops okay and then we'll do double crochet in the next chain then in the next two chains we'll do double crochet two together so yarn over go into the next chain pull through go again into the next chain pull through yarn over pull through two loops then yarn over pull through the last three loops like that Okay, so now we'll make the fourth leg so we'll do chain six one two three four five and six and then in the second uh, in the fourth chain from the hook one two three four we're going to slip stitch then chain three one two three slip stitch in the same uh, stitch that we slip stitched the previous toe and then again chain three one two three 
then slip stitch slightly before the other uh, stitch the other space that we slip stitched to close the gap like that and then we're going to do single crochet in the remaining two chains okay so single crochet and then single crochet okay then continuing to the body we're going to do the improvised uh, double crochet so we're going to go into the next chain over here put our crochet hook through then pull through and then do normal double crochet like this so pull through two stitches then pull through the other remaining loops like that okay and then we'll do double crochet in the next chain double crochet and then half double crochet in the next chain and single crochet in the next chain single crochet like that so this is how our little lizard looks like so far as you can see so now we are going to start making the tail and we'll do a chain 26 so chain 1 2 3 4 5 and continue until you have 26 chains okay so after we have the 26 chains now we're going to slip stitch in the second chain from the hook so we are going to count 1 2 and here we're going to slip stitch and then we are going to do single crochet in the next chain and then increase in the next chain and we're going to do that two times so we are going to do single crochet then single crochet increase so we're going to do two single crochet in the same chain so single crochet and in the same chain we do another single crochet and then we repeat again so single crochet then single crochet increase and then we'll do half double crochet in the next three chains so half double crochet then half double crochet in the next chain and half double crochet also in the next chain and then we'll do double crochet in the next five chains so we'll do double crochet one then double crochet in the next chain two double crochet in the next chain three double crochet in the next chain four and double crochet in the next chain five Okay, and then after that now we'll do double crochet two together in the next two chains and then we'll do double crochet in the next chain and we'll repeat that for three times so double crochet two together
and then double crochet in the next chain so that's one time and then double crochet two together And then double crochet in the next chain so that's two times and then one more time double crochet two together and double crochet in the next chain okay now the ne uh, in the next uh, two stitches also two chains we're going to do double crochet two together so double crochet two together And then in the last stitch, uh, sorry, and then in the in the last stitch remaining, we're going to do single crochet. And then now here in the first stitch where we made uh, here at the very end of the body we are going to slip stitch which is at the very end here of the body so slip stitch and cut off the yarn like that so that's our little leader that's how it looks like as you can see So we're just going to do some finishing and then we're going to cut off the yarn so that's our little tail and our legs so you're just going to do the little finishing cut off the yarn and Put the two eyes over here as you can see in my previous in the one that I made before the lizard I embroidered two eyes over here at the very top at our head and then we are finished so guys if you have any questions you can ask in the comments below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe until next time bye